Hey y'all, so today's video will be about the topic of Keisha Kaylee, you guys. Yes, I know I did put a video out yesterday on this topic, but today, like I was telling a couple of y'all, I was going to do a updated video and I wanted it to come out for tomorrow. So you guys, I'm going to go ahead and do this video. Now, you guys, I wasn't continuing trying to do another video, but I did want to have a little bit of update on everything only because a few things have came up recently with your girl. And let me just tell y'all, Keisha just put out a video on her stepping back from her relationship. And I just want to say... That is the best thing you could be doing, Keisha. I hope and I pray that you are really telling us the truth. And the only reason why, well, you guys, let's just go into detail. Get a little tea, uh, get your wine glass, get your teacups, and let's just sip a little bit, okay? Um, so yesterday I dropped a video that was not my normal video uh something that i don't do on the norm but like i said in the video i had been thinking so hard on that video um i just it was on my mind on my chest so i did that video about like two or three weeks ago um you know in the midst of everything in the midst of all of drama um in the beginning i just wanted to speak my piece on why i unsubscribed to keisha kaylee which you guys i didn't get as much hate feed that i thought yes i did get like a lot of thumbs down but i also got a lot of thumbs um i wasn't trying to be really negative i wasn't trying to put any um just you know just i wasn't trying to be too harsh on your girl um just because i loved keisha kaylee when i was watching her I had an opinion on a few things that was going on in her life which a lot of people have commented on but you guys i appreciate all the love that i got um and like i said it was really no negative comments i probably got one out of the 18 or 20 comments down there. like i said that video was made like two weeks ago so you guys i'm just going to give a update opinion on Keisha Kaylee and what's been going on lately um you guys I have been skimming through a couple of her videos a little bit only because I did um take a little bit of notes um that I wanted to make sure I got my point across on some of the things that I'm going to be saying in this video so right now I'm going to look down um at a couple of notes that I do have so if you see me look down a little bit that's what I'm looking at a little bit of notes that I did um have so i wouldn't forget anything her videos and i did watch one full um video of hers that she recently put out and that was the one that she was saying she was stay, taking a step back um from her relationship i think that video was made about like two three days ago and i did watch the video to the beginning all the way to the end because i didn't want to miss anything especially when she had that you know that juicy title you know she's really good at making she's just really good at making titles to draw people in guys i was so so happy when she told everybody on that video that she was done with jeremy um she didn't say like she just said they broke said a few things that was going on in her relationship she did not agree with and she just needed a for me time and i applaud her all the way like i was just so thrilled so happy kish kaylee i'm really happy that you are taking this time hopefully i said hopefully because half of me feel like okay yeah she's taking a break from him they're done that's it they're not together the other half of me only because you guys it was said underneath a couple of your comments that your nails were done prior to that uh ass assumptions of me video and they were a green marbleish looking color you guys she still has that video posted go back on that video and if you go back to the recent video the uh taking a step back she had in the beginning of that video messed up those little messed up brown nails um you guys and all of a sudden 
at the end of that video i think it was like 28 minutes 28 minutes and one second or something like that along the lines of i'm trying to give y'all a timeline of where she was saying that she was done with jeremy that she was taking a step back step back um from him um her nails was done she still wanted to be with her baby daddy she wanted to make them work she wanted to you know just like any other woman will want to do um work it out with a baby's father you know what i'm saying be with the child's you know father have a you know two parent home instead of having a one parent home and i feel her she's been she's been trying the whole relationship i feel like keisha you've been trying my opinion on it is you can't make a man stay with you you can't make a man you know do right by you the man has to do want to do right by you the man has to show you that he wants to do right by you so everybody was like everybody is just like she's playing us she's acting like she she broke up with him in real life she's probably still with him keisha i want to say this if you are lying about being with him which i'm not i'm not saying that you're lying let's just make that clear i'm not saying that you're lying i'm saying if you are lying saying that you're taking a step back and all this other stuff trying to make trying to save face because that's what that's what that's what that will be doing trying to save face and people find out that you are still with your baby daddy you're gonna lose your subscribers you're gonna lose people loyalty people are gonna think that you're lying to them you know you may have your your dedicated subscribers you may have your dedicated keys uh, your dedicated dons but people that's thinking like me they're not gonna subscribe to you now you guys when i first seen that video the uh taking a step back because i'm gonna be going back and forth with the with the two right now um i was happy i said you know what i have to give keisha kaylee another try if she's really like if she's really doing her right now i want to go back and subscribe you know but you guys when i heard that um when i seen that her nails had changed in all the in those two videos and people were really putting their point across and people were commenting and, and they got no answers from her and still we have no answers we don't know if it's true and keisha me personally you don't gotta answer to nobody you do what you want to do you get what i'm saying it's your life it's nobody's life nobody can you know people can comment people can say what they want about it um i'm not gonna subscribe back i'm not gonna subscribe back to her channel right now i won't say that i'm never gonna subscribe back because i want to see my girl i want to see my girl flourish i want to see my girl grow i don't want to see her stuck with a man I know when a woman's reaching their breaking point i know how it feels for a woman to reach their breaking point i know how it feels to walk away from somebody that you love you get what i'm saying somebody that you don't want to walk away from i know how that feels but you have to do what's best for you you have to put right now keisha we're not just talking about you. You have to put yourself first. You have to put your kids first. That's number one in the book. That's it. That's it. That's all. Nothing else should matter but you and your baby. You got to really break your ties away from that man. And that's not me trying to tell you what to do. That's just me telling my personal advice for you um, as a woman, as another black woman not even just being black but just as a woman period another thing i wanted to talk about i probably will go back um to keisha and jeremy i wanted to speak on britney her best friend okay okay so she recently posted a video today. britney um she seems because i've been watching keisha for a long time i was subscribed to britney i no longer am subscribed to britney um only reason why i unsubscribed to britney i just didn't i wasn't interested in her life i wasn't interested in her blogs not saying the girl's boring i mean time to time i would watch you know what i'm saying but i'm not no brit um um i don't know what she call i don't even know what she call her subscribers but i'm not no brit um subscriber no offense girl i mean i see you doing your thing recently i have been watching you know like i said i, I watched her video times to time um but bernie it seems it seems like um you are a genuine friend to me i feel like yes Brittany did say a couple of shady things in that video that she posted and deleted now deleted to me i feel like Brittany was coming from like that's my girl if let me just say this i have best friends in my life i have i have a couple of best friends in my life and each of my best friends they serve purpose in my life they really do they serve a lot of purpose in my life Brittany is the friend that's just gonna tell you how it is 
um i don't i don't feel like i feel like a couple of things maybe yeah maybe she was being a little shady but we all don't know their friendship we don't know if she was being um funny or being shady maybe that's just her and that's how she directly come at her with everything that's probably how she talks to keisha that's probably how she gets her point across with keisha maybe she's one of them friends that that got fed up you you gotta think of it everybody everybody gotta think of it you gotta think about it let that would have been one of y'all best friends i'm talking one of y'all true best friends a best friend that you call your sister you know let that would have been one of your best friends and they would have seen one of your dude your dude out what you think your friend or your best friend would think about your boyfriend from here on out now she seen him pull up we talk about Brittany. she seen jeremy pull up with a whole nother woman and not her best friend y'all don't think Brittany got tired of seeing keisha get played y'all don't think keisha got i mean Brittany got irritated y'all don't think Brittany was just like damn my best friend out here looking dumb i'm tired of that i done told that girl about 10 times already like quit messing with him you know we don't know what she didn't told him but you know what i'm saying like just off of that strength i just feel like yeah Brittany, you was kind of shady on a couple of things but maybe that's your delivery maybe that's how you talk maybe that's how you let her know like girl you messing up i feel like she was a little shady but then again she was just breaking it down she was literally in that video that i seen because i seen it off of somebody else's i didn't directly see it see the video from the from the you know point a point b i've just seen off of other people's youtube channel but off the videos off the, all the video clips because they all added up you know everybody screenshot everything and everybody screen record everything um so just off of that video i just feel like her delivery was just i'm telling y'all a story i'm telling y'all what's going on i'm telling y'all about my friend and her relationship she ain't gonna tell y'all i'm about to be real i'm about to tell you everybody else trying to tell the business and don't know the business and i know the business because i've been in her business i'm here i've been in here it's so crazy to me keisha because it puts you back in this this mindset to me that you are a liar like how, how i've been seeing it you you try to put up this persona you try to put up this big old persona how how perfect you are you know what i mean and then and then at bits and pieces you want to put that you cuss and that you hood and how you got that atlanta voice and doing this and doing let's that go, let's take it even more back when you and jeremy when y'all was telling us about jeremy having a baby you was trying to make it along up it was a one night stand that girl was only this just a smash pass when your best friend just told us the tea and said jeremy been messing with that girl since 2018 what so you telling me that that man was messing with her for a one night stand really i don't believe it and now we know we know for sure it's 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 not it's not true like you lied about it you and jeremy lied about it you sat there and and you didn't even question it have you had a conversation with that woman you get what i'm saying and then for you to blame that on that woman that woman don't owe you no loyalty what do she owe you your man owe you the loyalty he's the one you sleeping with he's the one you're breaking bread with that's the one you had your kids by that's the one you got a house with you got that car in his name you need to be checking him about it you get him i'm praying for you i hope you do i, I hope you like just get over this whole situation if you and jeremy work it out y'all work it out if y'all do not y'all do not it's good girl that's not gonna be the first man that's not gonna be the last man just because you have three beautiful baby girls do not mean nobody else will want to be with you you are the prize remember that if you're gonna deal with him you're gonna be dealing with baby number baby mama number two so if he needs to go over there by himself because she don't want you to come that that can happen if she wants to do something with just her family and that's not including you that can happen you want to be actually sharing your man you're sharing him and you got to realize that i've been in a situation with like men with kids and other baby mamas and it's hard that's a, that's the hardest thing a woman can do so you need to literally really think about this keisha you need to really think about this make sure this is the, the decision that you want to make so you guys i just want to get on here um 
to do a updated video i want to tell y'all how i felt recently um about this keisha uh situation um let me know how you feel in the comment section um let me know if you feel like britney was wrong i mean i don't care if you if you disagree with me that's i'm i'm good on conversating about this like i said this is just my opinion on everything i had to make an updated video because some of y'all some of y'all was coming for me some of y'all was coming for me a little bit like hey this video is old she's not even with him well how do you know <laughs> how do we know like i said y'all i am like split half i am she's done with him she's doing her and i am at this like she lying she lying to us she lying it's something in my senses right here on the side saying that you lying Can go ahead and give this video a thumbs up go ahead and subscribe to my channel if you are not subscribed yet